Welcome to another edition of Pray As You Go, a short prayer session of 10 minutes or so where we sincerely believe that your expectations are turned into manifestations to the glory of God. So this is episode 123, 123, and we're praying, um, our prayer is titled From Bottles to Wells, From Bottles to Wells. Scriptures are run through um, Genesis chapter 21. Um, it's from verse 14 to 19, the KJV version. But um, we want to, the, the essential um, text is verses 14 and 19. But to put it in context, I will read the whole um, passage. And it says, And Abraham rose early in the morning and took bread and a bottle of water and gave it unto Hagar putting it on her shoulder and the child and sent her away. And she departed and wandered in the wilderness of Beersheba. And the, and the water was spent in the bottle. And she cast the child under one of the shrubs. And she went and sat down over against him a good way off, as it were, a bow shot. For she said, let me not see the death of the child. And she sat over against him and lift, lifted up her voice and wept. And God heard the voice of the lad. And, the, the, and God heard the voice of the lad. And the angel of God called to Hagar out of heaven and said to her, What aileth thee, Hagar? Fear not, for God has heard the voice of the lad where he is. Arise, lift up the lad and hold him in your hand. For I will make him a great nation. And God opened her eyes, and she saw a well of water. And she went and filled the bottle with water and gave the lad drink. Um, Matthew 14 16. Matthew 14 16 to 17 to 21, the NLT version. But Jesus said, that isn't necessary. You feed them. But we have only five loaves of bread and two fish, they answered. Then he told the people to sit down on the grass. Jesus took the five loaves, two fish, looked up toward heaven and blessed them. Then, breaking the loaves into pieces, he gave the bread to the disciples who distributed it to the people. They all ate as much as they wanted. And afterward, the disciples picked up 12 baskets of leftovers. About 5,000 men were fed that day, in addition to all the women and children. Ephesians 3 verse 20, the NKJV version. Ephesians 3 verse 20, it says, Now to him who is able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above all we ask or think, according to the power that works in us and finally psalms 108 verse 12 psalms 108 verse 12 the kjv version it says give us help from trouble for vain is the help of man vain is the help of man so abraham was a very wealthy man and ishmael at the time was his first biological son he only just had isaac as a wealthy man sending his son away for a lifetime he was only able to provide a bottle of water the bottle wouldn't have lasted that long i'm sure he felt when well this will sustain you as far as you will find water where you're going and you can refill it but god is the one that is able to sustain us again and again he gave them, uh, he opened her eyes to see a well of water. And we know that under normal circumstances, it's rare for wells to go dry. She could have so many bottles from that well. So we're going to pray. And the Lord is, is the one who also took the two fish and five loaves of bread. And it, it went further. So we're going to pray and thank God because he's able to exceed our expectations at any time. So we're going to say thank you, Lord, for your ability to exceed my expectations every time. Thank you, Jesus. 
Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, because you're able to exceed my expectations. Anytime I pray to you, you're able to do much more. Thank you, Jesus. We're going to say, Lord, forgive me for every sin of doubt and unbelief that has hindered my progress. Lord, forgive me, forgive me, forgive me for every sin of doubt, every sin of unbelief that has hindered my progress in the name of Jesus. We're going to pray again and say, oh Lord, let every diminishing blessing in my life be revived and be multiplied. Every diminishing blessing in my life be revived, be multiplied, be revived, be multiplied, be revived, be multiplied in Jesus' name. We're going to pray again and say, I decree and I declare that my few shall become overflowing my ev and, and everlasting blessings in the name of Jesus. I decree and I declare that my few shall become everlasting blessings, overflowing blessings in Jesus' name. We're so her fifth prayer point, we're going to pray, Oh Lord, my Father, I rise to help. Man gives bottles, but you give wells in the name of Jesus. Father, arise and help me man gives bottles for you but you give wells open my eyes to the well you have created for me and take my bottle open my eyes to the well you have created for me open my eyes to the well open my eyes to the well of blessings in the name of jesus we're going to pray again and say oh lord this month give me blessings that surpass human comprehension in the name of Jesus, give me blessings that surpass human comprehension. Give me blessings that surpass human comp comprehension. Give me blessings that goes beyond human comprehension. In the name of Jesus. We're going to pray again and say, Oh Lord, arise and give me a miracle of multiplication in the works of my hand. Give me a miracle of multiplication. Give my children miracles of multiplication. In all we do, in all we lay our hands on, multiply, 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 multiply multiply in jesus name we pray our father and our lord we want to thank you lord because you are the giver of all things you are able to do exceedingly abundantly above all we ask or think of thank you because when the the the, the debtor widow of the prophet was suffering and she had only a little oil in the house you made that oil go further. You not only pay her debt, you sustained her for a lifetime. You took the you took the bottle and you replaced it with a well. Father, we thank you. Thank you because with the widow of Zarephath, she had only a little oil to 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 eat, and she intended to eat and die with her her son. But alas, when you came in with your well, she was able to sustain herself until the famine was over. You are the Lord that helps and helps indeed. Arise, O oh Lord, for our sake, so that man will not gloat over us. Father, do that which only you can do. Exceed our expectation. Go beyond what we have prayed for multiply that which we have let our few become multiple let our few become overflowing to the glory of your name in jesus name thank you our father and our lord for we have prayed today in jesus name amen thank you for tuning in and praying along with this um version of um, edition of prayers you go god bless you the scriptures, the song, the prayer points are in the description box below as usual. Please remember to press the like button before you leave. Leave your comments. I, I always try and, and respond. Subscribe if you haven't done so and share to bless others. And until I come your way again, may the Lord replace you that bottle that you're holding to open your eyes to see the well of overflowing blessings that he have prepared for you. And may your testimonies be full in Jesus' name. Amen. Shalom.